What's going on everyone? It's Brain Witch Code You Find Jewelry, your personal jeweler. Today is a great day. Why? Because we're adding new pieces to the site. Now at the end of 2017, I realized I just got caught with just being too busy and not keeping up with the demand. So out of the gates in 2018, I made the video where I said one of my primary goals was to double the amount of things on my website. And that is really just to prepare for the later months of the year, just kind of like 2017, I realized and I was too busy to go on the website and add a bunch of this stuff. So I want to take the first part of the year to do that. And I'm really listening to what you guys are saying and how what the trends are. Now, the, the main thing, the first big batch of things are going to be these Mariner bracelets I'm adding. Um, I'm going to do most of the sizes. And then as well, I want to circle back to more female pieces. That's going to also be a big focal point and with more chains and different designs, of course, for everybody to wear. So I have a lot of different options. I just haven't been able to upload them to the website because um, to upload to the website, it actually is a lot of work um, and you have to be precise. There's times where I've rushed that process and then ended up being wrong. Like I measured a 24 inch and it was really a 26 inch or something like that. Um, and the gram weights ended up being off and the price being off. So you got to go back and fix them. That's just a little behind the scenes. So you got to have really a lot of time to sit down, measure it, weigh it, measure it again and weigh it again five more times just to make sure you're okay and then go put all that stuff and, and do all the, the, the leg work that entails. So enough talking. That's pretty much all I do all day or you guys know me as just a talker. Let's show you the pieces we're shipping out and also the new pieces. Right off the bat, we're gonna take a look at some pieces we usually don't see on these videos. We have the Jakoji Angel piece. It has the diamond eyes on the back. It's got the little hook. A very nice piece to wear. Again, here is the Diamond Jesus piece. A lot of you guys have been asking me to showcase this piece. It just has the crown, the diamond eyes, the back is solid. Very nice piece. If you like the Jesus piece, you want a little extra bling, then get the one with the diamond crown. And then here is the medium diamond cross on the website. Very nice as well. And then the angel wing. The good thing, and I'll put these all next to each other. The good thing about these pieces and how I design the sizes is they're meant to stack with one another. So you could pick 22, 24 and wear these types of pieces together. It's really fun to do that. Um, you just kind of add and, and go with the chain you like, different lengths, different sizes. It's, it's all fun. So you just stack those together. Or they're all about the one and one quarter, one and one half inch. Um, going down this row, we have the flat curves, two and a half millimeters. A uh, few Miami Cuban. Here's the 10 millimeter, my favorite, the 8 millimeter. So there's a pretty big jump when you get to the Cubans. My boy Mu Yanzi got a four millimeter flat curve white gold. And then we have a four millimeter Mariner chain, some rope chains. I believe that's a three and a half. The puff link right here, the 8 millimeter. Another one, some Figaro's here, two and a half Franco. Uh, four millimeter rope chain, four millimeter flat curb, a three and a half millimeter rope, two and a half white gold, one and a half six millimeter bracelet. The bracelets are the name of the game. We have the five millimeter Franco chain here, two millimeter Figaro, some 2.9s. We got another, the two millimeter Mariner, another rope, more bracelets here. Now, the whole thing with this week was the flat curve bracelets. I have, I think, eight of them going out. They're all right here, and then there's some on that size. Four millimeter Miami Cuban link and some three millimeter Franco chain. So check out all these things. I got a box up right now. And because you guys are liking the flat curve bracelets, I decided to go ahead and add what I had onto the website of the Mariner chain. Now the Mariner chain is definitely picking up a lot of steam as of late. I think I've been advertising them pretty well because I believe in these links very strongly. I compare them just like the flat curve here, a solid durable chain, but you really don't have to spend the same amount of weight as a Cuban link. So from left to right, two millimeter. Now for all my fellows out there, the two millimeter is just a very simple bracelet. Don't order the two millimeter expecting a ten and a half millimeter because it's just very delicate almost buy your girlfriend your wife one of these and get you maybe the four and a half or the five and a half and have a matching set so we have two millimeter three millimeter 
uh, four millimeter, four and a half millimeter, the five and a half I've displayed on my Instagram, the five and a half on me, the seven millimeter, and then the big boy, the ten and a half millimeter. Now keep in mind, these are just the ones I had ready. All of the of the widths on my website I can make into a bracelet. So if you like, let's say the eight millimeter, I could, if you want to order one of those, I could just cut it and make a bracelet. I just had these ready to go so you guys can see. And then also we have more studs added to the website. Check these out. These are ball, these are basically like moon cut uh, links, but they're diamond cut. So it's kind of hard to show this here. Um, but if you guys just see, let me get a little closer here. There it is. So we have this small, small, maybe this is for like a one, two year old daughter. Um, very small and these weigh pretty much nothing. They're hollow inside just like a moon cut chain would be and then they go up. These are pretty big. Um, you know if you really want a nice gold and they're diamond cut they just really flash. Very nice and I'll have those on the website. Now we have more diamond cluster studs. Again with this camera it's very hard to focus. These are the bigger ones that are on my website already. I just wanted to compare so these would be like large and these would be the medium, and then we have the small here. So if I can kind of go from a distance, you could see they're, they're nice every day. If you have a daughter or just want to get your wife something, Valentine's Day is coming up, then go with the smaller ones. But again, I would say these are more for men, the bigger size, um, but these ones are definitely more female size. Or if you want something simple, it's just a cluster design. Go on my website, you'll definitely see the design a lot better because the photos will be enlarged. But those are just the new additions to the site. Before I forget, here are all the Mariners on my wrist uh, so you guys can kind of see the sizes here. Um, I know a lot of you guys will be interested in that two and three millimeters, so the side by side there is important to show. And I really like all these. Again, if you're going to go with the smaller size, you have to know that they are small. When we're talking only a couple millimeters, that's not very big, but when you stack other bracelets with it, or if you just kind of like the casual look, then okay, it's for you. And then for the people that want a solitaire Mariner, then up my arm is probably your ballpark as well. Um, the 10 and a half, the five and a half, seven millimeter. Again, I, all the sizes on my website, I can make bracelets. Just email me if it's not posted on there. And there's a look at that. Now the best thing to do at this point in time is just to hop on over to that beautiful jewelry site, jacoji.com, and just check it out and see if those bracelets work for you. I Again, I really, really, really like the, the Mariner chains and the flat curve chains. I like Figaro's. I was never really a fan of Figaro's. Um, they are growing on me and that's kind of how it works with a lot of different things with people. You might not like something at first and then you work with it and then you it starts to grow on you. But I like those flat chains because they sit well on the skin, they lay right, and they're very durable. I've never had an issue with a flat, like the flat curve chain never had an issue. I've never had an issue with the Mariner chain as well. So I'm not just pushing like a hollow rope chain on you because you know the price sounds right and I still make my margins. But in reality, a week later, you're going to have a broken chain. I do think the, the Mariner bracelets are a nice, classy, casual, comfortable, I had to add another word onto that, a comfortable uh, bracelet to wear. And that's a big thing on the wrist because if you're like me, I get really irritated with things around my wrist. They don't fit right. They're too wide, too skinny. But I found that the Mariner chain is great. The flat curb is great as well. And then like for example, that my 10 millimeter Miami Cuban link, I can never wear that every day because sometimes it just gets a little too, you know, it's just a little too chunky when I'm driving. It kind of gets in the way, um, you know, when I'm changing the radio, just little stupid stuff, but I'm very particular, very detailed how I like to wear my jewelry. That's why I like to keep it different pieces for kind of different occasions. So hop on the site, check the new pieces out, and then I will be adding those rope bracelets soon. That's it for today's video, and we will see you on our next jewelry video.